United USA 2020 and beyond. So the UK is going full communist. It says travelers from the red list countries have to pay 1700 So what is going on here? All right, so 1750 pounds for a 10-day hotel quarantine, says Matt Hancock tells MPs that responding to the new variant is mission critical to protecting ourselves in the long term. Okay, that makes sense, sure. But what is really going on here? Uh, people being forced to pay money? I mean, in the UK and Irish residents returning from the 33 red list countries will have to pay £1,750 to quarantine in hotels for 10 days, Health Secretary Matt Hancock told MPs. It says as part of the new quarantine system due to come in to force uh, from Monday next week, the government has booked 4,600 rooms across 16 hotels for those arriving from certain areas. All right, well, it says the action has been uh, taken as part of the government's response to concerns that the new COVID variants that uh, allegedly are more infectious, which could be more resistant to vaccines, might be imported from abroad. Hmm. Well, it seems like uh, the long arm of the law is stretching out. Uh, passengers, it says, will uh, have to book online before traveling. 1,750 pounds, I mean, that's more than a couple thousand dollars. I mean, in U.S. money, I mean, it's, you know, it's a lot of money. You know, it says including the cost of the COVID testing and the escort between the airport and their designated hotel food, accommodations, and security. Oh, gee, so generous. Food, accommodations, and security. Sure. Says uh, Mr. Hancock told the House of Commons that by responding to the new variants as soon as they arise is mission critical to protecting ourselves the long term. Of course, detailing the new border ma measures, the health secretary told MPs passengers will only be able to enter the UK through a small number of ports that are currently account for the vast majority of passenger arrivals. Hmm. Okay. Sounds like communism to me. Uh, yeah. So I wanted to break this video down in half the time. That's why I deleted it and I'm re-uploading it right now. Go ahead, get it out there, like it, share it, and let people know, uh, you know, this is an overhaul of our civil liberties.